All right, uh, let's do Parkinson examination. So if you have a look at the patient's face, uh, you will see lack of facial expressions. You will see less frequent blinking. These are because of muscle rigidity. Also, if you notice, patient has got a typical stooped posture. So these are very important for Parkinson's inspection. So in the examination, if you will see, patient has got resting tremors. Usually you, can, you say pin rolling tremors. Then you can do few tests to check the bradykinesia. So this is finger tapping. You can tell the patient to do it 10 times. Then we have got uh, hand grip. After hand grip, we have got this supination and pronation. So you tell the patient to do any of these movements. If you tell them to do one, that should be enough. And the fourth is this toe tap. So out of finger tapping, hand grip, pronation, supination or toe tap, you try doing one at least. Let's check the tone uh, of the upper limbs. Usually we are looking for lead pipe rigidity and cogwheel rigidity. Now if you have a look at the gait, uh, usually patients have got short shuffling gait and patients usually take few steps in the initiation of the gait and they're going very slowly and if you look at the posture it's a stooped posture and have a look how the patient will turn patient will take a lot of steps in turning around and again it's a stooped posture short shuffling gait that is typical for Parkinson's disease. Thank you.